When it comes to the development process, you'll need a software stack that is both standardized and consistent. Does Mean Stack meet the criteria? Let's find out and watch this video till the end to discover the top five brands using the Mean framework. You're on the Jelvix channel, weekly videos on tech in five minutes. Don't forget to subscribe. Well, Mean is a relatively new stack that refers to the collection of four user-friendly full-stack JavaScript frameworks, such as MongoDB, Express.js, Angular.js, and Node.js. These frameworks are typically used for building dynamic, fast, and robust cloud-ready apps and websites. It's worth mentioning that there are multiple variations to the Mean stack. However, the Mean model is one of the most popular technology concepts for building web and app full-stack solutions today. Now, aren't you wondering how Mean stack architecture actually works? Okay, we'll explain. In the first stage, AngularJS is the foremost one to start processing the client request. In the second stage, the client request goes into the Node.js server through the JavaScript server-side language. In the third stage, the Express.js framework is then implemented into the process to perform a database request. In the fourth stage, MongoDB retrieves the data and sends the response to Express.js. And finally, in the fifth stage, Node.js returns the data to AngularJS to showcase the outcomes, and in return, the data is taken back from Express.js. You're probably eager to know about the most significant advantages that make Mean so important in development today. So, Mean is a simple open source model of full stack development. It's 100% based on JavaScript language. Mean enables rapid development of various applications, it requires extremely low memory, Mean helps to avoid unnecessary groundwork, and it allows smooth processing of multi-thread simultaneous connections. Have you ever used any open source framework for development? How was your experience? Drop a comment. Now, we're going to analyze the profitable pitfalls Mean Stack programming covers. Well, MongoDB is an ideal choice for small to mid-sized development projects and isn't recommended for large-scale applications. Node.js features poor performance for resource-intensive requests. There's no specific general JavaScript coding guidelines. Once the mean stack technology was applied, it's really hard to switch back to the old approach. Mean features poor isolation of servers from business logic, which might be critical for certain projects. And there's a probability of losing records potentially. By the way, we highly recommend you check out the article with a detailed comparison of TypeScript versus JavaScript. The link is in the description. And I'm sure you're dying to know where Mean was successfully applied. We won't keep it a secret anymore. According to Stackshare, over 50 brands and enterprises with worldwide recognition use the Mean framework in their tech stacks. These include companies such as Uniqlo, Accenture, Angular Class, and Vungle. The functionality of Mean Stack components has given it the ability to develop dynamic applications, which are robust, fast, and maintainable. There's many reasons why this model is worth it, namely effective prototyping abilities, reduced development costs, supplied project development, testing, and deployment, effortless code transferring and use, straightforward data transfer, and no need for deep expertise in LAMP. In the upcoming decade, Mean Stack is expected to recommend itself as a lightweight solution compared to alternative models. Mean Stack architecture is an excellent option for web and app development, especially for small and mid-scale cloud solutions. Have you already thought about using it in your next project? This video was prepared by the Jelvix team. We help top brands worldwide to innovate and accelerate digital transformation. We share the latest news weekly about tech trends and innovations. So make sure to subscribe not to miss a single video. Also, share which topics we need to cover next on our channel. And don't forget to press the bell button. Bye for now.